Hello and welcome to the 26th Eurovision Song Contest coming to you from the ODS in Dublin. Now before we get down to the contest proper, we have a film to show you. It's a montage of scenes of Ireland showing you some of our crafts and culture. So let's relax for the next three minutes or so. Beautiful film showing a simple of Ireland to the world. The music for that film was specially composed by Noel Keelan and played by the Autoe Concert Orchestra with leader Loretta Nelson and conducted by Noel. And now the girl with the big job tonight, Dira Nivria. Agus Mila Falter Royal Quick and Fisheo, Comortus Auronich, the Orifisha, a Tachrelanuft of Laclea. Tamid and Saw and Oris and Royal Dublin Society, Cummin, a Tachaki at Kayagablian, Erin Sail, Emlian. 
Beg fitir sunamich the Hamortus Nahi Hanucht, Agas begin Klar Achrela and Naitir Hafihid, Master Gomeg, Reshis Quikir Milun Dine Egeshikling, Tasuligam Gomenishiv Anahanev Asanihi. Odiran is best known at the moment for her daily show on Radio 1, Women Today. She made her first broadcast at the age of eight as a child actress. And later, while still a student of French and Spanish at UCD, she got a job as continuity announcer with RTE. In 1972, she began reporting for television, magazine and current affairs programs. She went to Kenya for a year and returned home in 1976. In 79, she went back to Africa and made an hour-long documentary on Tanzania. Later this year, she'll present a new television series called Han Medan. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to the 26th Eurovision Song Contest, which is coming to you tonight from Dublin. We are here in the Royal Dublin Society, which this year celebrates its 250th anniversary. There will be artists from 20 countries competing in tonight's Grand Prix, and the program will be transmitted in 29 countries to an estimated 500 million people. The order in which the songs will be presented has already been decided by the drawing of lots. The singers will be accompanied by the Radio Telefish Ailen Concert Orchestra and before each song we'll be showing you a short film of the artists and composers filmed here in Dublin during the Eurovision week. So now it's time for the first song in the Eurovision Song Contest 1981 and I'd like to wish the artists and the composers the very best of luck and I hope that all of you enjoy the evening. This country is Austria, with a song called Wenn du da bist, When You Are There, written by Werner Bumler. He comes from Lynx and works in an engineering firm there, and has been composing songs since he was a teenager. He's also a lead singer in a band called Concord, but he won't be singing tonight. Singing the song is a chap I met last year in The Hague, when he was a member of the group Blue Danube. He's 22, and he's had lots of success in Austria, on television and radio. He's also a songwriter, and will be recording his first album next month. His name is Marty Brown. Now, conducting the orchestra is the conductor of the Austrian radio and television orchestra, Richard Osterreicher. Now, Austria won the Eurovision Song Contest once in 1966. You may remember that. Hugo Jorgen sang a song called Merci Cherry. Here is Richard Osterreicher, conduct the orchestra. Giving a rose to Loretta Nelson. I think it was a rose. Marty Bram for Austria. When you fought and all the Vögel singen do, when you fought Und die Blumen blühen doch, bin ich einsam. Und all die Menschen um mich her tun, als ob nichts geschehen wäre. Wenn du fort bist, hör ich das Vogel singen nicht. Wenn du fort bist, gibt selbst die Sonne trübes Licht. Was ich tue, es ist alles fad und leer. Dann fehlst du mir so sehr. Wenn du fort bist, laufe ich ohne 
Erzählung her ganz verloren. Fühle ich mich ausgehöhlt und leer, wenn du fort bist. Habe ich keine Pläne mehr, dann fällst du mir so sehr. Ich atme deine Nähe mir ganz nah bist und ich in deine Augen sehe, wenn du da bist und ich dich in die Arme nehme, dann vergessen wir die Welt rings um uns her. Wenn du da bist, sehe ich die Bäume wieder grün. Wenn du da bist, sehe ich die Blumen wieder blühen. Wenn du da bist, ja dann wünsch ich mir so sehr, bitte geh nicht fort, nie mehr. Von Budapest. Marty Gray and Frosty. I don't know what the girl in the uh, helmet had to do with the song because it was just a love song. When you were there, I sit beside the telephone. When you're not there, I dream day and night alone that you are there. And I lie in your arms, but then I know I miss you so. I love you. Don't go. I suppose it takes all kinds. Well, next we have Turkey. And their song is called Du Me Du Lap, written by Ali Kuchakape, who's had a very varied career. He's a journalist who also produces music programs on television and radio, produces records, does football commentaries, and has made some records, and indeed has won many song contests. The, the Brendan O'Reilly of Turkey, you might say. Well, recently, he gave it all up to go back to journalism full-time. Well, singing for Turkey are a group who were the first to combine Turkish traditional music with classical and pop music. They call themselves Modern Folk Trio, and they're joined for the Eurovision Song Contest by a girl called Shadow, who is, in fact, a ceramics worker making her first personal appearance. So if you're looking for a few tiles for the bathroom, I'll put in a word for you. The conductor is Uno Tunch, who comes from Istanbul and began his music career in 1961. He can play lots of instruments, but his best at the bass guitar, I'm told. He was in Paris, indeed, for the Eurovision in 1976. So for Turkey, Dome Dula, which means carousel.
went down very well. Turkey and modern folk with Dume Dolap, which means carousel. There are actually 29 commentators chatting away here at the moment. 20 countries, as you know, are taking part in the contest. And altogether, 40 TV and radio services in 30 countries are relaying the contest. Well, two of Germany's best-known composers have written this year's song, Johnny Blue, Ralph Siegel and Bern Meinunger. They wrote last year's song, which came second, and they're also responsible for the 1979 German song, so they're no strangers to Eurovision. Singing the German song is a very vivacious blonde girl, Lena Valetis, who comes from Lithuania and moved to Bavaria when she was still a child. She joined a group straight from school, but it wasn't until she made her first record that success came to her. She now lives in Munich with her husband, and she has a little son called Marco. So Lena Valetis is going to sing Johnny Blue for Germany. The conductor is Wolfgang Rudelberger. Wolfgang is a well-known artist in his own right. He's been a singer and guitarist with many jazz groups and has composed many hit songs, selling millions of copies in Germany. He's also the arranger of theatre, which came second Johnny Logan last year. Very distinguished looking gentleman around the ODS all this week. Lena Valetis for Germany and Johnny Blue. isn't she? That's Alina Valetus and Johnny Blue. <laughs> the Germany has never won the Eurovision Song Contest, but that's the favourite during the week. And indeed, uh, this evening's papers in Dublin, the bookies, put that at number one. But we'll have to wait and see. Nice girl, though. Well, Luxembourg are next, and they've won the contest four times, but then they pick composers from all over Europe. You may remember Phil Coulter wrote their song one year when Geraldine sang for them. Well, this year's song was written by three composers, Sophie Marco, Jean-Claude Petit, and the singer Jean-Claude Pascal, the oldest swinger in town. He's 54 and won the contest in 1961. 
He's one of the best-known singers and actors on the continent, having appeared in over 40 films and has had dozens of hits in France and Luxembourg. He indeed received the Legion of Honour from the French president for his work as an artist and has appeared with some of the most glamorous stars in the world, so no wonder he has that glint in his eye. Conductor is Joel Rocher, making his first appearance in Eurovision and indeed his first time to conduct a big orchestra, he tells me. Up to this, he's been writing songs and playing guitar in a small group. We certainly wish him well tonight. The song is called Secret à l'Amérique. It may not be America. Sung for Luxembourg by Jean Claude Pascal. It may not be America, sung by Jean-Claude Pascal for Luxembourg. In some of the countries, they are receiving this program by satellite. A special Earth station has been installed here and it beams the program to OTS. That's the European satellite is picked up by countries like Cyprus, Dubai and Israel. And Israel's song is called Halela and sung by a group Habibi, regarded as one of the top groups in Israel. They were formed in 1974 when Shulmet Aharoni, a very well-known actress and singer, met up with the three lads, Uval, Kiki and Ami. Shulmet and Uval fell in love, got married and have written many songs. And indeed, uh, Shulmet is expecting the patter of little feet in a couple of months' time. That's one for the girls. Now, they wrote the words of Halela. The music was written by Shuki Levy, who was born in Israel but lives in California, where he's been working on films. The group have won the Harp of David Award twice, which is a big honour in Israel. Israel, of course, have won the Eurovision Song Contest twice in 1978 and 1979. The conductor is Eldad Shram, a very well-known musician who has worked in America as producer, composer and arranger in the 1970s and has twice represented Israel in the Eurovision Song Contest as composer and conductor. For Israel, then, Halela, sung by Happy Eve. Thank you. 
Cheers from their own delegations. That's Lalela from Hakidi for Israel. You may notice the centerpiece of the set is a representation of the Celtic Gold Talk. And uh, just above the stage area is the crown designed from the original 2nd century bonds. It's really beautiful. Well, from Denmark come Tommy Seabach and Debbie Cameron, very well-known singers in their own country. In fact, in this week's top ten in Denmark, Tommy has three records in it, including their Eurovision song, Kola Ella I, Straight or Curly Hair, which is number one. Now, Tommy sang in the Eurovision in 1979 when Debbie was one of the backing singers. And since then, they've worked together a lot and they had the top single of the year last year. Debbie now has her own band and Tommy is also a record producer. He wrote the music for the song. The words are by Kel Hike, who up to recently had his own group and has just formed a duo with his wife. The conductor for Denmark is a very well-known musician in jazz circles, Alan Butchinski, who has been named Danish Jazz Musician of the Year and is a member of the Radio Big Band there, as well as performing with many groups. Kula Ella I, for Denmark, sung by Tommy Seabach and Debbie Cameron.
Curly, not to Curly. Curl all the songs seem to be getting equal applause, I think. It's uh, Tommy Seabat and Debbie Cameron. Ola Ella I for Denmark. Actually, you wouldn't think this was the same place that the Indo Horse Show or Thunderland was held. It's completely transformed. It. Fantastic it is. Yugoslavia song uh, is written by Ranko Boban, who works with Yugoslavia Television in their music department and has quite a lot of success with his songs. He's been writing songs since an early age, and indeed, talking to the composers, you find that most of them have been writing songs and playing an instrument from the time they were children. But singing for Yugoslavia is said Mimic Vatta, who started off with his local brass band, and moved on to various pop groups before turning to cabaret, which seems to be the pattern all over the world, doesn't it? He's had a group called Heavy Industry, a touch of Yugoslavian heavy metal, but he wanted to sing more beautiful songs, he told me. The conductor is Ranko Reichmann, who is conductor of the Radio Television Light Orchestra in Yugoslavia, and he has won numerous awards as an arranger, and indeed has arranged the song this year. So for Yugoslavia then, Lela, sung by Selmemik Vatta. Sačuvao sam ljubav svu, o, samo da si ostala tu. Ali nisi željela to, ali nisi željela to. Nikad te niko neće voljet ko ja. Nikada. TV, you would notice I think that the colours can be mixed or completely separated to suit the music or the costume of the artist. And that's why I think most of the singers seem to be wearing white tonight and put different colours behind them. And Paddy Brady is the man looking after that. Well, Finland featured the reggae beat with a song called Reggae OK, written by Jim Pembroke and Oli Ohanta. Now, Jim is an Englishman living in Finland since 1965 and has had a big influence on Finnish rock music and formed two bands, Blues Section and Wigwam. Both bands have done very well for him. Now, Oli is more a rock singer than a songwriter, has his own band and has just issued his first single and has written many songs before for the singer Ricky Sorsa. 
Ricky started off as most singers do in a semi-professional group, got fed up with the music business and left it for a while to concentrate on finding the right songs and the right musicians. And he thinks he's found them and they're playing with them tonight here in Dublin. The conductor is Otto Donner, who was recorded in Finland as one of the most progressive musicians experimenting with electronic music. Plays a lot of jazz and was one time head of light entertainment in the Finnish broadcasting company. Obviously a popular man with the Finns. A touch of the discos now for Finland with Reggae OK from Ricky Sosa. Here at the ODS. Reggae OK, Ricky Sorsa from Finland, doing his Ron Stewart. Indeed, the ladies tell me he's just as sexy. Jean Gabelou sings for France. He was born in Tahiti and is a big hit with the ladies also here in the ODS during the week with his romantic voice. He became the most famous singer in Polynesia but wanted to find success away from home, so he sailed for France. There he met Jean Paul Cara, the songwriter, who says, Love is the most important thing in my life. Without love, there is no life. Very romantic, these French fellas. He wrote the song that won the contest in 1977 and wrote a song that was second one year. Indeed, France have won the contest more than any other country, so they have to be watched closely. The words were written by Joe Gracie, who comes from Algeria and has collaborated with Jean-Paul Cara on previous occasions. He's also a poet. Conducting for France is a genius from Casablanca. He started to sing at the age of two, started to play the piano at the age of eight. And music is his life, he told me. His name, David Springfield. So for France, Jean Gabelou, from Manahum. Sur une galaxie en l'an 
available, I'm told, is a million watts. I don't know what kind of a fuse you'd want, but I'd say the ESB are very happy. Spain's song is called Isolo Tu, and Only You, sung by Michele, who comes from Barcelona, and started singing in various groups while still very young. Now, he's toured a lot outside Spain and is better known in Latin America, where he's had five hit singles and two hit albums, and has recently been rehearsing for Jesus Christ Superstar. The composer is Amado Haim, who comes from Morocco and was another child genius who was a wizard on the guitar at the age of 12. Five years later, he joined a group called Los Diablos, who were tremendously popular in Spain. They broke up in 1976. He then became a recording engineer and record producer. The conductor is Juan Balcón, another well-known musician in Spain, where he plays mostly classical music. He conducted last year. Isoro too, and only you, sung by Bacelli for Spain. Isolo tu, isolo yo, enamorados en la playa bajo el sol. No hay nadie más alrededor Y en la arena yo dibujo un corazón El viento enreda tus cabellos Como queriéndote acariciar Y solo tú, y solo yo El cielo azul y en tus ojos el amor Mirando el mar 
abrazamos con la fuerza de un ciclo. Nada, 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 nada es igual si tú no estás. Me quedo con mi soledad de tu rincón. Igual si no estás tú, no, 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 no. Y solo tú, y solo yo, sabemos todos los secretos del amor. Y solo tú, y solo yo, en nuestro mundo tú te alegre y soñador. Entre mis brazos yo te beso. Siento en tus labios fuego abrazado Y nada, 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 nada Es igual si tú no estás Me quedo con soledad en un rincón oh, oh. Nada, 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 nada Es igual si no estás tú oh, 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 oh. Y solo tú Y solo yo Sabemos todos los secretos del amor Y solo tú, y solo yo En nuestro mundo tú te alegre y soñador Entre mis tratos yo te beso Siento en tus labios fuego abrazador Y nada, 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 nada es igual si tú no estás Quedo con mi soledad en un rincón oh, oh, oh. Nada, 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 nada Es igual si no estás tú Solo tú and only you, Bacchelli, for Spain. Well, we're exactly at the halfway mark. We had ten, ten to go. And Ireland, by the way, have been drawn twelfth. So the one after the next. It is in wonder. It's a miracle. Is the song this year for the Netherlands, written by Bart van der Laar and Kees de Witt. Now, Bart was born in Holland, but after finishing school, he went to Belgium, where he worked in radio and television. In 1977, he came back to Holland, where he runs a record company. Kays was born in Indonesia and came to Holland in 1946 and went to college in The Hague. He sings with a girl called Monique and they have a very successful career there. Linda Williams is the singer for the Netherlands. She was born into music. Her father plays trumpet, saxophone and guitar and is also a conductor of an orchestra. And Linda started in her father's orchestra when she was six. It's extraordinary, as I said earlier, most of the singers have been performing since they were babies. Now, Linda is married to a music teacher, and they have two children. The conductor is Roger van Otterloo, one of Holland's foremost conductors, a very, very well-known man of music in Europe, and he's shortly going to take over the famous Metropole Orchestra, Dolph van der Linde. Linda Williams, It Is In Wonder.
Four times in 57, 59, 69, and 75. Well, our song is next. It is, of course, Horoscopes, written by Joe Burkett and Jim Kelly, who are brothers-in-law. Now, Joe lives in Dublin, Jim in London. Joe writes the music, sends it off to Jim in London, and he puts the words to it. And it certainly worked this time when they won the National Song Contest. In 1972, Joe wrote Kjolan Gro with, with Liam McUshting, which uh, Sandy Jones sang for Ireland. Singing our song, three lovely girls, Gold Sheba. That's Maxie, Marion Fawcett and Frances Campbell. Maxie sang for Ireland in 1973. Marion is one of the famous Fawcett Circus family and has worked as an acrobat, as a contortionist and indeed on the high wire. Frances was a well-known folk singer from Derry before teaming up with the other two girls. I was talking to Maxie just before the contest and she says, say a wee prayer for us. Well, conducting the RTE Concert Orchestra is a man who's no stranger to Eurovision. He's conducted for Ireland several times. Very, very popular for the other conductors here and with the musicians from all over Europe. So it helps them tremendously. And that's, of course, an old Kilo. Fingers crossed. Here we go. Shiva and Horoscopes. every day to find out what the stars have got to say about the fortunes that are on the way it's crazy Ladies. 
Bathsheba and horoscopes. Next we have Norway, and Finn Kalvik is the most popular artist in Norway. His uh, album, Wake Up to Love, stayed at the top ten for a year and sold over 85,000 copies, which is a record in Norway. In 1977, he met Benny Anderson of ABBA, who became his arranger and record producer. And somebody told me indeed that Benny was coming over for the Eurovision Song Contest, but I haven't met him so far, but if I see him, I'll let you know. And with his help, Finn had a hit in Sweden, something no other Norwegian artist has ever done. He has a fantastic personality and a great sense of humour, and he's very popular here with everybody all the week. Now, he wrote the song himself. The conductor is Sigurd Janssen, who is also a composer and has won many prizes for his arrangements and won the Nordrin Radio Prize twice. So for Norway, we have Aldri Ilivet, Never in My Life, sung by Finn Kelvick. in my life for Norway. For most of the music on the little introductory films is traditional music of the country concerned, arranged by Michael Casey, who also composed some of them. And actually, Dr. Jared Victory wrote the piece specially for the Irish film. But one of the hot film favourites, indeed, is Making Your Mind Up from Bucks Fears for Britain. The group was specially formed for the Eurovision Song Contest and consists of Jay Aston, Cheryl Baker, Poppy G and Michael Nolan. Michael is one of five brothers born in Dublin. His mother comes from Cork. And he's been singing in pubs and clubs before turning professional in 1977. 
Cheryl has an Irish grandmother and was a member of Coco, who sang for Britain in 1978. The song was written by Andy Hale and John Danter. Andy is a session musician and has had his songs recorded by Cliff Richard and her own Johnny Logan. And John Danter is also a session musician and he tells me that he collects old broken down cars in his spare time. The conductor is a man who has worked with international stars like Frank Sinatra, The Three Degrees, Dana and Shirley Bassett. His name, John Coleman. For Britain, it's Box Fears, making your mind up. Spheres for Britain and making your mind of a very strong song indeed. Dick Michael, who is the second from the left, told me that he was delighted to be home and he had a great time showing the members of the group around Dublin. Well, the Portuguese song is written and sung by Carlos Paio. He's 23 and was studying to be a doctor in Lisbon when he wrote the lyrics and composed the music for a children's song which took the imagination of the nation. He then wrote a funny song called The Song of the Kiss, which became one of the biggest selling records in Portugal last year. Suddenly, the, the medical student had become one of the most popular composers in the country. He then decided that he'd sing himself, and he made a record called Souvenir of Portugal, which became very popular, and indeed now he's one of the most popular singers over there. The conductor is Segundo Galasha, who was born in Spain, who has been living in Portugal for a long time. He has taken part in over 300 television programs in Portugal, Spain, America, and in Canada. The song is a catchy little song called Playback. We're a wild audience here tonight in the ODS, no doubt about it. All right then, the Portugal, Carlos Pio, and Playback. <laughs>
basta acertar, não tem nada que enganar. E assim mesmo sem cantar, vai sem cantar. Em playback, em playback, em playback. A boca fecha a boca, não tem ganas, não tem ganas. Vais ter uma apoteose, põe em pose pra agradar. Em playback é que tu és bom a cantar sem fugir do Podes não saber cantar, nem sequer assobiar Com certeza que não vais desafinar Em playback, em playback, em playback Só precisas de acertar, não tem nada que enganar E assim mesmo sem cantar, vais sem cantar Em playback, em playback, em playback for Portugal and play back. In case you're wondering what that song was all about, well, the meaning of it was that you don't have to be a singer nowadays when you go out on the stage. You just have to have a tape. Doesn't matter who's singing it, nobody will know. Just play it back and mime to it. Well, Belgium's song this year is called Samson and Delilah and was written by Kick Dandy and Penny Els. Now, Kick started off in show business as a singer and then uh, started a light and sound company. But when he met singer Emily Starr, he forgot all about light and sound and was concentrating on writing and producing for her. And I wouldn't blame him at all. She started her singing career at the age of 13 with a ballroom orchestra and later studied at the Academy of Music in Brussels, where she met Kick Dandy. She's recorded several singles, and at Medem this year, she was presented with her first gold disc. She usually sings with her sisters, Nikki and Helene, but they're not singing with her today here in Dublin. The conductor is Giuseppe Marchese, who was born in Italy and is a well-known arranger and conductor, and also has written many songs. So for Belgium, Emily Starr and Samson and Delilah.
very foxy lady. That's every star, Samson and Delilah for Belgium. If you've ever been here in the audience, then you'll be a huge problem with sound. And the sound boys here have a fantastic job. We put a circus tent strung across the roof, and the orchestra is surrounded by little perspect fences, and each stringed instrument has its own microphone. Well, the Greek song is called Fagari Ekalokerenio, Summer Moon, as written by the singer Yanis Dimitras and Yorgos Niakros. Now, Yanis is 27 and was born in Corfu. He started his career at 17, singing in a small cabaret, and got a good grounding in the entertainment business. A few years later, he made his first record, and has appeared in quite a few song contests around the world. It seems that Jesus Christ Superstar has been performed all over the place, and Yanis played Peter in the Greek version. The co-composer is also the conductor, Yorgos Neakos. He made his debut as a conductor in 1966, and since then has worked with most of the famous Greek performers, and has his own orchestra playing in the well-known nightclub in Athens. The girl at the piano, by the way, is Sophia Chandra. So for Greece, it's Yanis Dimitras and Fagario Calicernio. Dimitras and Fugare Carocarino, Summer Moon. And indeed, it's been like summer here all the week. Beautiful weather. All the artists and television people go back with a great impression of our lovely country. The man above was certainly taking care of us this week. But for the very first time, Cyprus are in the Eurovision Song Contest, and a group was specially formed for the occasion. They call themselves Island. 
is made up of a student, a young mother who likes to play football, that's one way of keeping fit, an athlete and a pop musician who studied classical piano. There's an interesting story about the composers, Doros Yoyardus and Stravros Sidaras. They were born in the same town in the same year, married two sisters, and have been writing music together since 1975. Doros was studying law but gave it up when he signed his first contract with the record company in 1970 and by 1975 was established as a singer-songwriter. Stravros went to London to study architecture and while there in 1968 recorded several of his songs. Both of them are working on a musical version of Helen of Troy. The conductor was born in Egypt and since 1978 has been conducted in Cyprus. His name is Michaelis Rosakis, known as Mike to his friends. The saxophone player asked me particularly to mention his name to the people of Ireland. His name is Philippos Zemberalis. So, there you are, in case you want to book him for a gig anyway. There's a very distinguished audience here tonight with the Minister of Transport and Communications, Albert Reynolds, and the Lord Mayor of Dublin, Fergus O'Brien, and lots more people. I met Dana on the way, and two looking absolutely gorgeous. Well, singing for Switzerland are Peter, Sue, and Mark, who began singing together in 1969 and made their first Eurovision Song Contest appearance in 1971 here in Dublin at the Gaiety Theatre. But after their appearance in 1976, they got international recognition and have gone from success to success, both in Switzerland and abroad, with a dozen hits and two gold discs. Six, they got international recognition and have gone from success to success, both in Switzerland and abroad, with a dozen hits and two gold discs. Now, Peter writes the songs and produces the records. Mark manages the group, organising the concert tours and the appearances and so on, looks after the money, in other words, and Sue looks lovely and sings beautifully. And she's American, by the way, but has lived in Switzerland since childhood. Now, the words were written by Nella Martinetti. The conductor is Farol Zukowski. 
co-producing the trio since 1976 and a very, very successful composer in his own right. Essence me without you. Peter, Sue and Mark for Switzerland. Three, four. song and a very, very polished group. In Sensate, Me Without You, Peter Suermark for Switzerland. There's Albert Reynolds, the Minister of Communications and Transport. Last country, would you believe, is Sweden, and the song is written by singer Bjorn Schwifts and Bengt Palmers. The song means caught in a dream. Now, Bjorn is yet another multi-talented musician, playing on other things, piano, organ and trumpet. He formed his first group at the age of 15. He had some success, but he went solo in 1969, and within a year, had become Sweden's most successful solo artist. In 1973, he once again formed a group called Blue Swede. Their first single, Hooked on a Feeling, made number one in Sweden, and also number one in America, where it got a gold disc. It's several hits, but decided to disband in 1975, and since then, Bjorn has continued to have a successful solo career. Bent Palmer's co-composer is a record producer, and he started in show business writing his own songs. The conductor is Anders Berglund, who comes from Stockholm. He's never been anything but a musician. He started playing the piano at seven, and the minute he left school, started work as a musician. He's conducting for Sweden for the third time. Fan get it in drum. Caught in a dream for Sweden, Bjorn Schwifts. Yeah. Där händer det att natten är lång I mitt hus Där känner du någonting är på gång Och när dagen börjar skymma Bjuder oron upp till dans Du 
man in Sweden, Bjorn Schwifts, caught in a dream. Well, there you are. It's the 20 songs. No doubt you're a favourite of your own, but hard, I'd say, to pick out a winner of that lot. We're back to doing Those it again. Those are the 20 songs for this year's contest. While the juries are making up their minds, we're bringing you some music and dance, which has been specially commissioned for this evening's programme. Time Dance, composed and arranged by Donal Lunny and Bill Whelan, is a three-part sequence of music and dance. The first part is a traditional reel played on illin pipes and baurong. The second part is a newly composed piece in the style of the 18th century harpers, while the third section illustrates the influence of contemporary music on the traditional form. Time Dance is performed, the music is performed by Planksty, one of Ireland's best-known traditional music groups, and the choreography is by Anne Courtney. Well, the set for the song contest here is the largest in the history of the contest, designed by Michael Grogan and constructed by dozens of carpenters, painters, electricians and stagehands. It took 14 articulated trucks to move it section by section from the Donnybrook workshops to the ODS. It measures 150 feet across, 80 feet deep and 30 feet high. The materials used in the construction of the set and surrounding area include 5,000 square feet of plywood, 3,000 feet of steel tubing, 1,800 square feet of perspex and 5,000 square square feet of carpeting and it's a Le massive and magnificent to be all pulled down tomorrow to make way for the horses. We're going to see a beautiful uh, piece of music now, Time Dance it's called. An ant a tamid a fanunt leshna tarhi os nagureha or fodna horpa, big kyol agas rinke a going a hordig special to the hike klar nahi hanucht. She had thrown a lunny, Agus Bill Whelan, on Rupert Planksty, a home, Agus a Horig time dance. Sakiat Bart, Clashamid Reel, a hind er Bibelin, Agus er Mauran. She had passed a Tharna part, na Pisa Nohumha, a steel flashori, na Hotu Ishadiag, Agus Lerin, and three part, Tunacher and Hyol, no Einshire, er in Shana Hyol Dokish. She had Planksty, a hindhig and Hyol, Agus she and Courtney, a Horig and Rinke.
time dance as we return to the Simmons Court Pavilion of the Royal Dublin Society grounds. Huge grounds in Ballsbridge in Dublin where it's held the Royal Dublin Society Horse Show. And here many concerts are held, both symphony and pop. Queen were here recently. Did a Nivrian once again. Now it's time for the voting. And to begin with, I'd like to introduce Frank Neff, the official scrutineer of the European Broadcasting Union, who will be supervising the voting procedure. Good evening. Good evening, Frank. You're very welcome. There's a jury in each of the 20 participating countries, and they will award 12 points to the song gaining the highest number of votes from their jury, 10 to the second, 8 to the third, and 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1 in order of preference. They'll vote in ascending order, starting with the song which has gained the lowest number of votes. And of course, no jury will have heard the votes of the preceding juries. So now it's time to call in our first jury this evening, and it's Austria. Guten Abend. Bonsoir, Autriche. Puis-je avoir vos votes, s'il vous plaît? Allô, Dublin. Ici Vienne. Bonsoir. Voici les résultats du jury autrichien. Allemagne, 5 points. Allemagne, 1 point. Germany, 1 point. Sa non, non, 5 points. Je répète. Point. Allemagne, 5 points. Je m'excuse. Allemagne, 5 points. Okay. Germany... Excuse me, uh, I'm just talking now with the, the Austrian jury. You have forgotten that we sh you should start by ascending order, giving as the first point one, two, three, etc. So I can't understand why you start by five. <laughs> Uh, bonsoir Autriche, est-ce que vous avez compris? Uh, il faut there. commencer avec Frank le numéro 1, puis le numéro 2, 3, 4 et ainsi de suite, s'il vous plaît. A box in the ears for Austria. Belgique, un point. Belgique, That's un more point. Like it. Belgium, one point. I should think so. Suisse, deux points. Suisse, deux points. Switzerland, two points. Pays-Bas, trois points. Pays-Bas, trois points. Netherlands, three points. Royaume-Uni, 4 points. Royaume-Uni, 4 points. United Kingdom, 4 points. That's a disappointing Allemagne, though, 5 points. Allemagne, 5 points. Germany, 5 points. Grèce, 6 points. Grèce, 6 points. Greece, 6 points. Irlande, 7 points. Irlande, 7 points. Ireland, Seven points. That's going to be greeted with applause every time they get a good mark. Israel, eight points. Israel, eight points. Israel, eight points. Luxembourg, ten points. Luxembourg, ten points. Luxembourg, ten points. Were they listening to the same songs that I was? That's what I want to know. France, 12 points. France, 12 points. Well, Jean Gabilou looks um, delighted. Et ceci termine les points attribués par le jury autrichien. Bonsoir. Frank Neff has a word or two to say. Could you go a little bit more slow, please? Certainly. Thank you. Frank asserting himself. Our next jury is the Turkish jury. Yakshamlar, good evening, Turkey. Could I have your votes, please? Hello, Dublin. Ankara calling. Here are the results of the Turkish jury. Denmark, one point. Denmark, one point. Denmark, un point. Switzerland, two points. Switzerland, two points. I'm getting to look as if Suisse, melody is out. Two points. Ireland, three points. Ireland, three points. Ireland, three points. Yugoslavia, four points. Yugoslavia, four points. Yugoslavia, four points. Netherlands, five points. Netherlands, five points. Pays-Bas, cinq points. Austria, six points. Austria, six points. Autriche, six points. Belgium, seven points. Belgium, seven points. Belgique, 7 points. United Kingdom, 8 points. United Kingdom, like 8 points. 
Royaume-Uni, 8 points. Spain, 10 points. Spain, 10 points. Espagne, 10 points. You see just how subjective Germany, popular music can be. Points. 12 points to Germany. Germany, 12 points. Allemagne, 12 points. And that completes the points of the Turkish jury. That Good means night, Germany's Dublin. in the lead. Good night, Turkey, and thank 17 you very much. points. Thank you. Our United next Kingdom well there with 12. Is the German jury. Good Abend. Good evening, Germany. Could I have your votes, please? Hello, Dublin. Munich calling. And here are the results of the German jury. Denmark, one point. Denmark, one point. Denmark, un point. Greece, two points. Greece, two points. Grèce, deux points. Netherlands, three points. Netherlands, three points. Pays-Bas, trois points. United Kingdom, four points. United Kingdom, four points. Royaume-Uni, quatre points. Not many points. there. Luxembourg, five points. Luxembourg, five points. Luxembourg, cinq points. Ireland, six points. Ireland, six points. Irlande, six points. Level pegging with the United Kingdom. Seven points. Switzerland, seven points. Suisse, sept points. Portugal, eight points. Portugal, Extraordinary eight variation points. in the scoring. Portugal, huit points. Sweden, ten points. That was the Sweden, final song. Good song. Ten points. Swed, Who's going to get the twelve points? And France? France again. Twelve points. France, 12 points. France, 12 points. That's France, 24 points. In the lead, ahead of Germany with 17. And with 16 each, the United Kingdom and Ireland. France in the lead. Bonsoir, Luxembourg. Puis-je avoir vos votes, s'il vous plaît? Oui, bonsoir, Iran. Bonsoir, Dublin. Voici donc les résultats du jury luxembourgeois. Turquie, 1 point. At last, Turkey, a point for Turkey. Un point. Turkey, one point. Suède, two points. Suède, two points. See, ten points Sweden, from the last jury and only two points. from this one. Allemagne, three points. Allemagne, three points. Germany, three points. Israel, four points. Israel, four points. Israel, four points. Royaume-Uni, 5 points. Royaume-Uni, 5 points. United Kingdom, 5 points. Grèce, 6 points. Grèce, 6 points. Greece, 6 points. Danemark, 7 points. Danemark, 7 points. Denmark, 7 points. Suisse, 8 points. Suisse, Huit points. That's the best set of marks they've had so far. Eight points. Irlande, dix points. Second best Irlande, score for Ireland. Dix points. Now who's Ireland, going to get the top mark? Ten points. France, France again. Twelve Et points. France, points. France, twelve points. I know nothing about Et European popular music. It's painfully obvious. Romana Home with Jean Gabilou. Our next jury is in Israel. Erev Tov, good evening, Israel. Could I have your vote, Scoreboard's please? gone a little awry. Ireland have now got 326 points, and nothing has been added to France. I think Frank Neff is going to have to jump in in a minute. Um, can I... Here he comes. There is a slight problem with the scoreboard. Oh, I'm sorry. I know how he feels from the song for Europe. France should lead now with 36, 36 points. That's right. Mm -hmm. Thank you. 312s. So then you can proceed now with the next number. France right, so we'll go back to 36. Israel. Israel, could I have your vote, Ireland please? with 26 in second place. Again. Mm -hmm. Belgium, one point. Belgium, one point. Belgique, un point. Finland, two points. First point for Finland. Finland, Two points. Only Norway Lander, and Cyprus have no points yet. Cyprus with no points. Luxembourg, three points. 
Luxembourg, three points. Luxembourg, trois points. Netherlands, four points. Netherlands, four points. Pays-Bas, quatre points. Cyprus, five points. That's the first set of marks for Cyprus, Cyprus which I thought was a five very points. upbeat and cheery song. Cyprus, five points. Thank goodness for that. Spain, six points. Spain, six points. Espagne, six points. France, seven points. France, seven points. It's a low mark France, for France. Sept points. Germany, eight points. Germany, eight points. Allemagne, huit points. Ireland, ten points. Ireland scoring well, scoring Ireland, steadily. Ten points. And second place now to Irlande, France. Dix points. United Kingdom. Top mark for the United points. Kingdom. United Kingdom, 12 points. That puts the United Kingdom in third place. And that completes the points. France of in the Israel. lead with 43. Thank you very Ireland much, the Israel second, 36. And UK now with 33. Our next jury, which is in Denmark. Good afternoon. Good evening, Denmark. Could I have your votes, please? Hello, Dublin West. Copenhagen calling. Here are the results of the Danish jury. Austria, one point. Austria, one point. Autriche, un point. France, two points. France, the variation two in voting points. is quite extraordinary this France, year, I think. How they can points. be given 12 by three Cyprus, countries. Three points. And then two points by somebody Cyprus, else. Cyprus, three points. Chypre, trois points. Switzerland, four points. Switzerland, four points. Suisse, Quatre points. Scoring disappointingly, I Sweden, think, Switzerland. Five points. Sweden, five points. Suède, cinq points. Belgium, six points. Belgium, six points. That's for the lady with Belgique, the legs. Six points. Samson. Netherlands, seven points. Netherlands, seven points. Pays-Bas, sept points. Germany, eight points. Germany, eight points. Unless Alemania, I miss my guess, Turkey points. have scored a point, but has been taken United back from them. Kingdom, ten points. Good mark for the United, United Kingdom, Kingdom on that. Ten points. Now Ryan who's going to get the 12? And now, listen carefully, Ireland, 12 points. Irish song doing very well for Sheba. Ireland, 48. 12 points. In the lead, France in second place with 45. The United Kingdom are 43. I'm sure Turkey have a point there, but it's been taken away. And Norway have yet to Good score. Good night, Denmark, and thank you very much. Uh, quite our like next the jury over is here. in Yugoslavia. Dobroveče. Good evening, Yugoslavia. Could I have your votes, please? Good evening, Yugoslavia. In the silence that followed. Again. They knew that Good evening, Yugoslavia. Frank Neff is on the phone. Votes, you please. can't see him. He's on the red phone. <laughs> Something has gone wrong. We have still some difficulties to get Yugoslavia, yes, but I think they are coming in. So it's fine. probably a Russian plot, you know. Moment. If if I could see the scoreboard, I think yes. it looks... Ah, ah, there you are, Yugoslavia. Yugoslavia, rolling through. Good evening, Yugoslavia. Can I have your votes, please? I don't have it. Yeah. Ah. Thank you very much. This, this is a bit of a problem here now because I think Yugoslavia are in a bit of a sulk. You just said that she doesn't have the vote. <laughs> Maybe the, the jury won't give her the votes. Yes, I'm here. Ah, there she is. Yes, Yugoslavia, I can hear I'm you. I'm calling Dublin. Belgrade calling Dublin. Do you hear me? Yes, can you hear me? Here are the results of the Yugoslav jury. Carry Thank on. you. Carry on, girl. Hello, Dublin. Hello. Yes. Okay. <laughs> Fine, thank you. Here are the results of the, the miracle theory. of television. Greece, one point. Greece, one point. Grèce, un point. Germany, two points. Germany, two points. Allemagne, deux points. Turkey, three points. Yes, they've Turkey, given them back that one point that points. they earned before. That brings Turkey, them up to four. Trois points. France, four points. France, four points. 
France, four points. France is scoring. France He's going up and down like a seesaw. Points. Ireland, five points. Ireland, five points. Pretty disappointed with Yvonne, that in the ball. Cinq points. Cyprus, six points. Cyprus, six points. Chypre, six points. Sweden, seven points. Sweden, seven points. Suède, sept points. Belgium, eight points. Belgium, eight points. Belgique, huit points. United Kingdom, ten points. Good mark for the United Kingdom. United Bringing Kingdom, them on a level with Ireland. Ten points. Royaume-Uni, dix points. Switzerland, Switzerland gets the... Eh? Switzerland, 12 points. Yes, yeah, Switzerland gets the Swiss top mark. Lose a point. How about time two? So they're making a late burst. We wish you a pleasant evening. Good night, Dublin. Good night, Yugoslavia. Good old and Belgrade. Thank you very much. 53 each. Our United next Kingdom jury and Ireland. Is neck the and Finnish neck. jury. Huva Ilta. Good evening, Finland. Could I have your votes, please? Helsinki calling. Here are the results of the Finnish jury. Sweden, one point. Sweden, one point. A cheery voice Sled, here. Un point. Belgium, two points. Belgium, two points. Belgique, deux points. United Kingdom, three points. United Kingdom, three points. No wonder she sounds so glum. Trois points. Trois points. Luxembourg, four points. Luxembourg, four points. Luxembourg, quatre points. Turkey, five points. Turkey, five Turkey, points. Turkey, five points. Turkey, cinq points. Israel, six points. Israel, six points. Israel, six points. Germany, seven points. Germany, seven points. Germany's still Allemagne, well there. Sept points. Yugoslavia, eight points. Yugoslavia, Pardon? eight points. Yugoslavia, <laughs> huit points. <laughs> France, ten points. Ten points France, to France. Ten points. Wonder if Ireland are going to get France, the twelve. Dix points. And Switzerland. Oh, Switzerland again. Points. Very late burst from Switzerland. Switzerland twelve points. That puts them right in the running. That means France are in the lead with 59. United Kingdom in second place, 56. Ireland with 53. And Switzerland coming up on the rails with 47. Now we come to our next jury, and our next jury is in France. Bonsoir la France, puis-je avoir vos votes, s'il vous plaît? Allo Dublin, bonsoir, ici Paris. Voici les résultats du jury français. Finlande, 4 points. Finlande, Un point. Poor old Norway Finland, haven't got a vote yet. One point. Pays Bas, two points. Pays Bas, two points. Netherlands, two points. Luxembourg, three points. Luxembourg, three points. Luxembourg, three points. Denmark, four points. Denmark, four points. Denmark, four points. Autriche, five points. Autriche, 5 points. Austria, 5 points. Irlande, 6 points. Irlande, 6 points. Six points from, Ireland, from the French six jury. Points. Royaume-Uni, 7 points. Royaume-Uni, 7 points. United Kingdom, 7 points. That will put the United Allemagne, Kingdom in the lead because France cannot vote for themselves. Allemagne, Huit points. Germany, eight points. Suisse, dix points. Suisse, dix points. Switzerland, ten points. Suède, douze points. Four marks for Sweden. Suède, douze points. Sweden, twelve points. Extraordinary. Switzerland, Ireland. Bye -bye. Well bye there, bye. France bye. too, but the United Kingdom now, in the lead with 63. This evening but then France the have jury. already Buenas voted. Tardes. They must be in with a very good, good chance. Now, 59. Espagne. Puis-je avoir vos votes, s'il vous plaît? 
Allô Dublin, bonsoir. Ici Madrid. Voici les résultats du jury espagnol. Luxembourg, un point. Luxembourg, un point. Luxembourg, one point. Finlande, deux points. Irlande, yeah. deux points. Finland. Pardon. Finlande. Finlande. Je m'excuse. Finlande, deux points. Finland, two points. Danemark, trois points. Danemark, trois points. Danemark, three points. Suisse, quatre points. Suisse, quatre points. Switzerland, four points. Irlande, cinq points. Irlande, cinq points. Ireland, five points. Autriche, six points. Autriche, six points. Austria, six points. Pays-Bas, sept points. Pays-Bas, sept points. Well, the Spain is certainly spraying the marks points. around. Royaume-Uni, huit points. Royaume-Uni, huit points. United Kingdom, eight points. Grèce, dix points. Grèce, Some well-deserved marks for the Greek entry. Greece, ten points. Est-ce que je peux vous demander encore une fois, Madrid, s'il vous plaît, oui. le, la dernière vote Grèce, 10 points. C'est Grèce Oui, c'est Grèce. Oui, merci. Et, Et puis... Allemagne, 12 points. Allemagne, 12 points. Full marks Germany, for Germany. 12 points. Marks, as I said, been sprayed around in all directions by the various international juries. I'm just looking at it here. 71, the United Kingdom in the lead. And in second place is Germany with 65, then Ireland with 64, and Switzerland with 61. Who are you laughing, Dublin? Hello, Dublin. Hilton calling. Here are the results of the Netherlands jury. Sorry, could you hold on a second? We have a slight problem with your counting. Yeah. Can I ask you in the Netherlands, please, to hold on for one moment? because we have a small problem here at the scoreboard. We'll be yeah. back with you in just a moment. We'll wait. Gets very Thank hairy you. at the old scoreboard here at the Eurovision Song Contest. Frank Neuf totting up there. Okay. It's, it's correct. You can proceed. Thank Fine. You. If I can come back to you again, uh, Netherlands. Yes, here we are. Switzerland, one point. Switzerland, one point. Suisse, un point. Denmark, two points. Denmark, two points. Denmark, deux points. Germany, three points. Germany, three points. Allemagne, trois points. Spain, four points. Spain, four points. Espagne, quatre points. Finland, five points. Finland, five points. Finlande, 5 points. France, 6 points. France, 6 points. France, 6 points. Israel, 7 points. Israel, 7 points. Israel, 7 points. Cyprus, 8 points. Cyprus, 8 points. Cheap, 8 points. Ireland, 10 points. Second best mark for Ireland. Ireland, 10 points. Could put Irlande, them in the lead. 10 points. United Kingdom, No, it doesn't, because the United Kingdom points. gets 12. United Kingdom, 12 points. Box Fizz in the lead. Royal We're making your mind up for the United Kingdom, Kingdom with 83 points. In second place, Ireland with 74. Good night, France Hilversum, are slipping out of the reckoning just a little. Our next jury is the Irish jury. Dear Smidarive, uh, Norway Hayden. still haven't Good got evening, a point. Dublin. Could I have your vote, please? Hello, Theron. This is Dublin calling, and here are the results of the Irish jury. Greece, one point. Greece, one point. Grèce, un point. Yugoslavia, two points. Yugoslavia, two points. Yugoslavie, deux points. Spain, three points. Spain, three points. Espagne, trois points. France, four points. France, four points. France, quatre points. 
Finland, five points. Finland, five points. Finland, cinq points. Germany, six points. Germany, six points. Allemagne, six points. Israel, seven points. Israel, seven points. Israel, sept points. Cyprus, eight points. Cyprus, eight points. Chypre, huit points. United Kingdom, ten points. Good mark from Ireland. United, United Kingdom, Kingdom, putting them well in the points. lead. Royaume-Uni, dix points. And Switzerland, twelve points. In my book, deservedly, four marks for Switzerland. Points. Still there with a chance. They're sharing second place the with Irish three countries, Slavis Ireland, Slavis. Germany Slavis. and Switzerland. Slavis. And in the lead, United Kingdom Our flashing there with 93 points. The Norwegian jury. Kukvel, good evening, Norway. Could I have your votes, please? No points yet for Norway. Maybe they won't give any points to anybody else. Here are the results of the Norwegian jury. Yugoslavia, one point. Yugoslavia, one point. Yugoslavia, un point. Greece, two points. Greece, two points. Grèce, deux points. United Kingdom, three points. Three points? United Kingdom, three points. <laughs> Royaume-Uni, trois points. Germany, four points. Germany, four points. Allemagne, quatre points. France, five points. France, five points. France, cinq points. Sweden, six points. Sweden, six points. Suède, six points. Cyprus, seven points. Cyprus, seven points. Chypre, sept points. Israel, eight points. Israel, eight points. Israel, huit points. Spain, ten points. Spain, ten points. Espagne, dix points. Who's going to get the top Switzerland, mark? Switzerland. Switzerland again. Switzerland, twelve points. Switzerland Swiss, now the closest points. challenger the to the United Kingdom. And again, the fluctuations in the scoring Thank you very from the much, different Oslo. countries has been quite now extraordinary this year. Our nearest More bizarre than usual. Vote. It's the vote from the United Kingdom. Good evening to you, And again, United we Kingdom. cannot Hello, vote for good ourselves. Hello, evening, Dublin, London. Calling here are the results of the United Kingdom jury. France, one point. France, one point. Heavens. France, un point. Giscard d'Estaing is going to like that. Sweden, <laughs> two points. Suède, two points. Belgium, three points. Belgium, oh. three points. Belgique, three points. Israel, four points. Israel, four points. Israel, quatre points. Denmark, five points. Denmark, five points. Denmark, cinq points. Netherlands, six points. Netherlands, six points. Pays-Bas, six points. Germany, seven points. Germany, seven points. Allemagne, sept points. Greece, eight points. Greece, eight points. Grèce, huit points. Cyprus, ten points. Cyprus, ten points. Chypre, dix points. Switzerland, twelve Switzerland points. Switzerland get the full marks. From the United Kingdom jury. Switzerland, Jury. 12 points. Suisse, 12 points. And that, dear Anne, completes and that the means that Switzerland... Do you think I'm going to win Thank my money? Much Switzerland are in the lead, 98, over the United Kingdom with 96. Scoreboard. And with 85, Germany. And, then the and Ireland, the moment, but we'll France with 75, and then Ireland with 74. Portuguese Ireland have kind of disappointing jury. mark oh, no, there. No Good mark evening. the United Kingdom. Could I have your votes, please? Hello, Dublin. Sloan, lad. Lisbon calling. Sloan Latt, she said. In, in Gaelic, that means goodbye. Finland, one point. Finland, one point. Finland, un point. Denmark, two points. Denmark, two points. Denmark, deux points. Spain, 
three points. Spain, three points. Espagne, trois points. Luxembourg, four points. Luxembourg, four points. Luxembourg, quatre points. Israel, five points. Israel, five points. Israel, Israel have been scoring points. very steadily. United Kingdom, six Only points. Six, for, six points for the United, United Kingdom. United Kingdom. Six points. Gone over Royal the top. Uni, six points. Netherlands, seven points. Netherlands, seven points. Pays-Bas, seven points. Switzerland, eight points. Switzerland, eight points. That means they hold the lead. Suisse, eight points. France, ten points. France, ten points. Coming France, back. France, ten points. Who's going to get the twelve? Germany. Germany points. get the 12 points. And Germany, 12 points. Ireland have had points. no points at all Allemagne, from the last two juries. And that brings Germany back in the reckoning. The so it's Switzerland in the lead, 106. United Kingdom slipping to second place, 102. Germany with 97. Belgium. France with 85. Belgium. Ireland, 74. Place. Hello, Dublin. Who you answered? Brussels calling. Here is the result of the Belgian jury. Ireland, one point. Ooh. Ireland, one point. Irlande, un point. Netherlands, two points. Netherlands, two points. Pays-Bas, deux points. France, three points. France, three points. Is nobody going to give Norway France, a mark? trois points. Sweden, four points. Sweden, four points. Suède, Sweden have done well for Bjorn Skis. Yugoslavia, five points. Yugoslavia, five points. Yugoslavia, five points. Greece, six points. Greece, six points. Greece, six points. Cyprus, seven points. Cyprus, seven points. Good scoring for the first ever entry from Cyprus. United Kingdom, Eight points. United Kingdom, eight points. Royaume-Uni, dix points. Pardon, huit points. Germany, ten points. Germany beginning to score Germany, very heavily. Ten points. Allemagne, dix points. Denmark, twelve points. Denmark, twelve points. Staggering. Denmark, Staggering. douze points. And that completes the votes of the Belgian jury. We are out and good night. Good night and thank you, Belgium. Well, that means that uh, with that Our next strange set of votes, there, the United the Kingdom is in the lead with jury. 110. Good evening, Greece. Could I have your vote, please? Hello, Dublin. Athens calling. Well, here are the results of the Greek jury. Portugal, one point. Portugal, one point. Portugal, un point. Yugoslavia, two points. Yugoslavia, Two points. Yugoslavia, two points. Netherlands, three points. Netherlands, three points. Pays-Bas, three points. Switzerland, four points. Switzerland, four points. It's a disappointing Suisse, mark for Switzerland. Quatre points. Germany, five points. Germany, five points. Allemagne, cinq points. United Kingdom, six points. And for the United Kingdom. United Kingdom, six points. Royaume-Uni, six points. This is going to throw it all up Belgium, in the air again. Seven points. Belgium, seven points. Belgique, seven points. France, eight points. France, eight points. France coming back. France, eight points. Ireland, ten points. And so is Ireland. Ireland. 10 points. Irlande, 10 points. Cyprus, 12 points. Full marks to Cyprus. That's the first Cyprus, set of full marks for Cyprus. I must say, I think they Sheep, deserve it. 12 points. But again, the marks and have been quite extraordinary. And it still Good means evening, the United Kingdom Greece hold the lead uh, at 116. Closely followed by Germany with 112 and Switzerland Kelly with 110. Evening, and France Cyprus, with 96. Could I have your vote, please? Bad line to Cyprus. 
Dear and Livrey. Good evening, Cyprus. Hello, Dublin. Ah. You can see a calling. Here are the results of the Cyprus jury. Sweden, one point. Sweden, one point. Swed, un point. Netherlands, two points. Netherlands, two points. Pays Bas, deux points. Yugoslavia, three points. Yugoslavia, three points. Yugoslavie, trois points. United Kingdom, four points. Oh, that isn't good for United us. Kingdom, four points. Ah. Royaume-Uni, quatre points. Belgium, five points. Belgium, five points. Belgique, cinq points. Greece, six points. Greece, six points. Grèce, six points. France, seven points. France, seven points. France, sept points. Germany, eight points. Germany, Drawing level eight with the United points. Kingdom. Allemagne, huit points. Switzerland, ten points. Second best mark to Switzerland. Switzerland. And that Ten means they've points. come up level with the United Six. Kingdom and Germany. Who's going to get the top mark? And Ireland. Ireland get the top mark. Well. Ireland, 12 points. 97, that makes Ireland 97. And it also, as I've said, these marks being sprayed around in all directions, and it means that there are one, two, three countries sharing the lead. Germany, United Kingdom and Switzerland. France are very well we there, and so are Ireland. We have two more juries to go, the Swiss one and the Swedish one. And as you can see, things are getting fairly close, but I think we'll carry on with the voting. Bonsoir, Suisse. Puis-je avoir vos votes, s'il vous plaît? Bonsoir, Dublin. Ici, Berne. Voici les résultats du jury Suisse. Irlande, un point. You see, one point for Ireland. Irlande, un point. And poor old Norway Ireland, still hasn't got a point. one point. Espagne, two points. Espagne, two points. Spain, two points. Chypre, three points. Chypre, three points. Cyprus, three points. Israel, four points. Israel, four points. Israel, four points. Finlande, five points. Finlande, five points. Finland, five points. Luxembourg, six points. Luxembourg, six points. Luxembourg, six points. Grèce, sept points. Grèce, sept points. Greece, seven points. Royaume-Uni, huit points. Royaume-Uni, huit points. Eight points. The United, United Kingdom. Kingdom, eight points. It's really close. Yugoslavia. 10 points for Yugoslavia. Yugoslavia, 10 points. Yugoslavia, 10 points. Who's going to get the big 12? France. France points. gets it. And that really has thrown France, it wide open. 12 points. Heavens above. 12 points. That's 115 to them. The United Kingdom is in the lead by 8 points. 128. Jean Gabidou there on your screen is the French singer with whom and whom. He took an early lead and then slipped out, but is coming back again. Last jury of the evening. Last jury. It's all resting with the Swedish jury. Good afternoon. Good evening, Sweden. Could I have your vote, please? Good evening, Dublin. Welcome, calling. Here are the results of the Swedish jury. Switzerland, one point. One point to Switzerland. Disappointing mark. One point. And they're out of it then. Austria. Austria, two points. Autriche, two points. Israel, three points. Israel, three points. Israel, three points. Denmark, four points. Denmark, four points. Denmark, four points. Luxembourg, five points. Tremendous tension here. Luxembourg, five points. Luxembourg, Cinq points. Finland, six points. Finland, six points. Finlande, six points. Ireland, seven points. Ireland, seven points. Irlande, 
7 points. Host country has scored very well. That's it. United Kingdom. United Kingdom, 8 points. That's it. I don't Royal think they Uni, can be caught. In fact, I'm sure they can. I'm sorry, I didn't hear that vote. Could you repeat your ten last vote, Ten points to France. Ten points. France, ten points. The United points. Kingdom have done it. Germany, Box twelve points. Germany, twelve points. Twelve Alemania, points to Germany. Douze points. And they're going to be in second place. They're going to be in second place. Thank you very much for your vote. In third place is France with 125, but you can see it flashing. The United Kingdom have done it again. Heavens! Heavens, they've done it again, but making your mind up. Another win for the United Kingdom. 136. Four points ahead of Germany with 132. Then France with 125. Ireland with 105. Sorry, Switzerland with 121 and Ireland with 105. The closest Eurovision Song Contest I've seen for a long and time. And winner of the Eurovision Song Contest 1981 with 136 points is the United Kingdom with Making Your Mind Up, sung... There's Mike Nolan in tears. Sung by Vox Fizz and composed by Andy Hill and John Danter. Up they come from the artist's rest area. Box Fizz. That's Jay and Cheryl. And Mike. And Bobby. And they're all very emotional, of course. They're being led on stage because uh, they get the award of the Grand Prix. And then they reprise the song and sing it for us once again. Number five in the hit parade in the United Kingdom. And I'll take a small bet that this might well go to number one in the British hit parade this week. The fanfare. <laughs> the doors have finally opened and out they come, embracing Andy Hill and John Danter, the writers of the winning song, Making Your Mind Up, sung by Bob Spears. Tremendous. It's yeah, absolutely beside themselves. That was a really, really close contest. I, as I said, never seen marks in the Eurovision being sprayed around with quite such abandon as they were by some of the international juries. It made me wonder if I had been at the same contest as they've been watching. And here to present the prizes are the winners of last year's Eurovision Song Contest, singer Johnny Logan and composer Shay Healy. Johnny Logan, who won it with Watson another year. Forcing his way through the door <laughs> with the bouquet and the Grand Prix trophy. Shay Healy, who has asked me to tell you that because so many people have been asking him how much money he won or he has earned from writing the winning song, that he is in fact wearing old money bags who have been made up into his suit. The Johnny Logan kissing everybody. There's Shay Healy in his money bags. Congratulations to Andy Hill and John Dancer. Marvellous for them. Let's hope it's just the beginning. And that too for Box Fizz. Very engaging and vivacious group. Their performance deserved that. They really, really gave it everything. Look at them beside themselves. Well, that brings us to the end of the 1981 Eurovision Song Contest. I hope you all enjoy the evening. And from all of us here in Dublin, a very good night to you. Well, Dylan Ivrian has had a hard time at that scoreboard. Some of the lines were a little slow coming in, but I thought she coped beautifully with it. And um, we had a little difficulty, but she remained sunny throughout. And she expressed herself beautifully too in French and Gaelic as well as English. Now, the group, Fox Fizz, are out there on stage, they're ready to sing. Reprise the winning song, the song that's going to hopefully start them on a the road to tremendous success. John Comer will conduct it as he did so well in the contest and throughout the rehearsals. They're ready to go. They're ready to jump all over the stage. Making your mind up. It's won it for the United Kingdom. Bucks Fizz.